It's better to give than to receive, right? Yeah. If you were to ask me this when I was younger, I would have never understood the full concept. But I didn't really understand it until my son was born, February 1st of 2004. He's three years old now, with uh, blonde hair, green eyes. He's a little runt for right now. Hopefully he gets a real spur. <laughs> I would have brought him in for a visual today. He's a little too energetic, and I think he's got ADHD. <laughs> so I brought a picture of him instead. But I'll pass this in there. Um, it wasn't until Christmas this last year when uh, he was fully able to uh, open his presents and understand Christmas. Um, uh, he was then able to open his own gifts and express his own excitement. He received a dinosaur, which is his favorite dinosaur, and uh, he was a little scared of it at first. Push a button and it moves around and his eyes light up. And, it's the first time he did that, he ran to his bedroom and kind of, you know, <laughs> scared of that. He also received some trains, but the tracks never stay together. So, you know, dancers are always ripping through the city and the town. And, <laughs> and then also, for my lifesaver, I also got him a portable DVD player to take on trips. You know, just to keep him occupied. This brings me to my next topic. During the spring break, we drove all the way down to uh, San Diego, the UCC World. Um, he really likes the movie Free Willy, so it was a good deal for him just to you know, see a whale. He's also into dinosaurs. So. Mm. When Shamu jumped out of the water, you should have seen his eyes. It was, it's really great. I don't know. can't explain it. just lit up. and. Wow. He's just so excited and screaming, look at Willie, look at Willie, you know. He also loved the dolphins, that was his favorite part, just jumping around out of the water and doing tricks. He almost got to touch one, but uh, swimming around doing other things. If you don't have any children to give gifts to or, you know, give attention to, I suggest you get one. <laughs> no, I'm just playing. <laughs> um, there are other options for you available. You can do a Make-A-Wish or a Big Brothers Big Sisters, which is uh, here in town. I got to go on a Make-A-Wish Foundation trip one time with my uncle down in Anaheim. Um, it's really for kids who, uh, who have like disabilities or are terminally ill. And you take them out for a good time and uh, show them, you know, show them a good time. We ended up going to a uh, Disneyland and bought them all kinds of souvenirs and stuff. That's pretty inspirational. It gave me the same warm feeling inside as what I do with my son. And then Big Brothers Big Sisters is basically the same thing, which is here locally. Um, after having my son, I now feel that I receive more through giving than I do by receiving gifts. That's all.